Hey, Mr. Mosquitoes, and we are back with Sandra Bullock. Um, her apparently her boyfriend died, and I was just like, "Damn, I don't know what happened to the boyfriend. I don't know." But let's see. Then I said to myself, "Well, Sandra, you're not so clean. Your hands aren't that clean, Sandra. Did you give up your boyfriend?" <laughs> Did you give up your boyfriend because you were supposed to sacrifice one of those children and you didn't? I don't know. Because you bought your kids too, I believe. Um, this whole blind side situation, that's lit. And I'm just like, I'm pretty sure that entertainment knew what the fuck was going on when... It happened. Do I think Sandra Bullock should get her award stripped away from her? It depends. Does she know the story? A lot of times they all know the story, but they have no problem with playing the part because it'll get them an Oscar or whatever the fuck, Emmy, or whatever the fuck they get. I don't care. Okay. However, when that movie came out, right, and my mother went and saw that movie. She was like, all of my friends, are, we're going to go see it, you know. It's supposed to be like the It movie, blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, a genome housing a nigga is a thoughtful story. Are you fucking serious? I told her, even back then, I said, I don't think that it went the way that they saying that it went. I said this to my mother. I did. I said this. She said, you always want to see things... In a bad light, Jessica. <laughs> no, I don't. I just see shit for what it is. Ursula. <laughs> Same thing about Bill Cosby. She was like, they just want to take a black man down. Yeah, but he's also guilty. He ain't guilty of all of them. But he's guilty at least 10 of them. Fuck. <laughs> His own daughter said he wasn't shit. He wouldn't go against her, uh, the person who raped her, Mike Tyson, because of his endorsements with Mike Tyson. If my daughter came to me and I was Bill Cosby, I, I don't give a fuck what money I got online, but he's a part of that money. He's a part of that blood sacrifice and shit. So he told his daughter to shut the fuck up and sit down. Uh -huh. Look it up if you don't believe me. She had a whole interview on Geraldo back in the um, early 90s, late 80s. Uh-huh. I wouldn't lie to you. Y'all know I be telling y'all the truth. Y'all know I be telling y'all. I don't be lying. I'm a little dramatic, god damn it, but I ain't lying. But anyway, this blind side bullshit is just one and the same. Sandra. Did you know Sandra? Or you just heard and you wasn't sure, but you still took the part. I ain't mad at you. Y'all do anything for money. Anyway. I just want to touch on basis of where were you and your boyfriend at the time of his passing, spirit angels and ancestors. <laughs> How does he see you? How did he see y'all's relationship? Sandra Bullock's boyfriend. What was his name? Did I write it down? Brian? Randall. Brian Randall. How did you feel about Sandra Bullock? <laughs> Brian, how did you see Sandra? Sandra, Sandra. The Seven of Wands in reverse. A tower. Girl. The tower. Yes, the tower. And I had the Seven of Wands in the reverse. And at the bottom, I got two of cups. Girl. Y'all relationship wasn't what it was. He see you as some type of... um sorcerer underhanded uh person he doesn't see you he doesn't see you as a person that is humble he doesn't see you as a person that has good intentions towards people he sees as, he sees you as a person that you do underhanded deals and i feel like Not to, 
the okay all right spirit is showing me the a balloon with poked holes i hope that that makes sense for whoever knows about their relationship i don't know shit about their relationship i didn't even know that sandra bullock was even dating any fucking body um the last time i checked she said that fuck love so i, I didn't know she was even fucking dating anybody but he doesn't see her as a humble person he sees her as an underhanded snake um and the thing also is probably some things was probably revealed to him as of lately um where he probably did not want to be in a relationship with her anymore because i got the tower moment happening and i think that it, it he got shown who she truly is and at the bottom we got the two of cups in reverse so i think that he had broke up with her because of what he knew about her practices or um yeah it's something about practices he found out some shit about her that she ain't no different from the right he found out some shit about sandra spirit angels ancestors come through this bitch give me more and um Chantel gave me some cards y'all i'm gonna use them today spirit angels ancestors how did you see sandra brian <laughs> how did you see sandra 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 i don't know which one it is is it sandra bullet or sandra bullet sandra sandra Ooh. the fuck that bitch ain't got no makeup this bitch look crazy as fuck this bitch just i got goosebumps <laughs> somebody just looked at me look like the crypt keeper <laughs> like they look like sandra bullock but they look like they just don't have on any makeup like their eyes are really panda god damn sodomize brian how did you see sandra shit that was two cards that fell out that's it and we got three of wands um and i feel like uh <clears throat> with that what the fuck spirit <laughs> ah i don't okay 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 i'm seeing true blood again but that scene where it's lilith covered in blood that's how i'm seeing this card so she, she is down with the sacrifice like he either saw her at a party or or she invited him to this party because it's like he's being introduced to something then we got these two cards right here um and i got the strength card and oh shit and then i got the nine of wands so um yeah I've got goosebumps again. Um, he found out that she was somebody that she tried to hide. And with the strength card in the upright, I feel like for in this particular situation, he she was showing him the strength that she has where she could stop things in his life. Like she could poke holes because I'm saying the whole poking again um even here uh with the seven of wands you see how it's poking something and how this how these wands are standing up and she's standing in a tent to let you know like she's the ruler of something but also with the strength card it's like he saw the two faced side of her and he didn't want to have nothing to do with that bitch and he was probably going to tell it because it's like he's saying some shit here it's like he she took him there I don't know. It's like she was introducing him to a different world or something. Because I'm seeing like a journey for him. Like, I'm equipped. But you have to figure out how to navigate through here. I don't know. That's what I'm getting, though. I'm not going to lie. That's what the fuck I'm getting. Um. Uh, let me see. Which deck do I want to do first? Let's do the new deck. Let's do the lover's oracle. Let's see how... Brian feels about Sandra Bullock in these cards. Brian, tell me how you feel in these cards. Tell me how you feel within the love oracle about her. Tell me how you feel towards 
wish it come sandra and then we're going to do the ratchet to the, the the ratchet 2.0 and we're also going to do the um karmic deck as well and we're going to pull a few from the crime deck as y'all know spirit angels ancestors i've shuffled these a bunch of times since my bitch gave them to me but <laughs> i love how big they are y'all know i like these big ass cards <laughs> spirit angels ancestors brian how you feel about sandra bullock how you feel about sandra brian brian shit at the bottom we got my life is a mess right now you are right i think that she threatened his ass and i think that uh she tried to manipulate his mind as well like you're not you're not ready yet i'm i heard you're not ready yet it's like he went for a role or something and she said you're not ready yet. but the thing is that he is really ready like he's it's like he'll be a better actor than you but she can't have that um i wish to be like you what the fuck i just say bitch what the fuck did i say she manipulates his mind to make him think that he's not that good at something. And so he wants to be like her, even though the thing is that he's actually better than her. She knows that he's better. That's why she pokes holes in his shit. What's this spirit? You deserve better. Listen, 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 listen. I feel like, he was right about a lot of things. And I feel like she was portraying her, projecting her feelings about herself onto him. And she really wants to be more like him. But the thing is that she can't take back the things that she's already done with her soul. And you deserve better. And the thing is that she know that he deserved better. He know that he deserved better. But at the same time, she's telling him otherwise. That's the type of person that she is. Oh, my God. I can't. My life is a mess. With It's like, it's almost as if she made him handicapped to depend on, to depend on her. I have to let you go to find myself in a split. This love is crazy. And I feel like that came through this because he was not for that shit. And then in the reverse, I got uh, what is the truth. And I feel like with the strength card, she was hiding her truth. And he found out who she truly was. I hope that y'all following the bitch right now. What's at the bottom spirit? We got four cards for that. Let me move on to the next. I got too many decks to go through. Um, in the reverse, I can't do this right now. In the reverse. I don't believe that she allowed him to walk away from her. I don't. He's dead. I don't even know how he fucking died. I don't. I still don't. Um, but I feel like he found out some shit about her that he was able to tell. And she wasn't going to allow him to tell it. That's what I believe. I think I'm going to put this on Patreon too. Because I ain't, um, I can just do a live on YouTube. I'll just do a live. Still, I just answer. Brian, how you feel about Sandra, Brian? Sandra introduced him to things he had never seen before. Showed him he had seen. He wasn't ready. He wasn't ready. He was ready for the entertainment industry as far as acting is concerned. But he wasn't ready for what that part of the entertainment. I had something that fell. Your police ass and insecure, jealous, and envious. What did I just say about this bitch? Didn't I just say how she would manipulate his mind to think that he's not as great as he actually fucking is? I'm through spirit. Your police ass. She was all up in his shit. Making sure he ain't get no fucking jobs. Remember I said that bitch was poking holes in a fucking balloon. Come through. Player shit. <clears throat> um, I think that Sandra Bullock is in. I always felt like she might have been into women. You know, because she looked a little hard in the face. And not a lot of men are really that much attracted to her. Because she looks very masculine in the face. But I think that she dips in the lady pool. I said that um that a long time ago. Come through spirit. 
um an addiction come through um i think the addiction is down with the with with uh this like um uh the occult type of shit like i think that that's an addiction for her and um i also I keep seeing her without the makeup and it's like these eyes are really distracting me um i'm not sure if she was like sodomized if she um if she goes it's i, I, I it's almost as if she she sacrifices her own body and i hope that them i'm trying my best to un understand that shit myself it's like she sacrifices herself her body her temple self and i don't know if she like allows them to sodomize her if that's like a thing because i keep seeing her without the makeup on but the biggest thing is like the panda eyes it's it's like the panda eyes for real cootie uh carmen cootie in reverse so like i said i think that this addiction is the occult and her sexual nature with that ah what the fuck what the fuck all right that's the last call for this day i'm under pressure um and it seems as it get a job bitch um so i think that with the i'm under pressure and get a job bitch i think that she's she uses this in order to consistently keep a job like this is her way of keeping this job like this is the way to keep it's like the light it's like the light to keep the job that's what i'm saying like i'm uh, who who is angel bullock who is she who is she brian Bad habits die hard. Get your money up. Like I said before, this is the way to keep the money up. This is the way to keep... It say get your money up. But like I said, and it say get a job, bitch. This, I wrote these cards for the same... Um, This is not my deck, but I wrote these cards for the same reason that I use these cards for. Because I'm just like, get a job, bitch. Get your money up. Like, this person either wants to get a job or has to do things to keep their job same thing goes here and then bad habits die hard get keep these are the fucking bad habits that sandra bullock be fucking having it's an addiction but she do it to keep her money up i said that it came right the fuck out who was who was sandra fighting a beast and arguing is right under get a job remember i said how she was talking to him right brian Spirit and angels and ancestors. This was during a relationship. I don't know what happened outside their relationship. Cheater big time. What did I say? Didn't I say she be lame with, 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 with bitches? Didn't I say that? Oh, shit. Two cards fell out. Mm. It's a secret baby and messy hoe. So, I don't know if he might have, if Brian probably had a baby on her or uh, why they broke up. He was probably cheating. I don't fucking know. I have no idea. But, um, I, I told y'all earlier that I felt like she dips in the side of lady pool. I, I told y'all that. Your sex is the best. So, one, somebody that she, somebody that she frequents, sex is better than his. Or, to her, his sex is the best. Box, I don't fuck with you in reverse. So, she didn't really fuck with him. She made the same life she did, but she really don't. On to the crime day. What is, do you know about Sandra Bullock, uh, Brian? What you know about Sandra? Expose her. What you know about her? What you know about her? What you what you know about her? <laughs> what you know about her? What you what you know? Them them eyes be sodomized. <laughs> her acting be cool. 
She waiting for her kids, her foreign kids, because she took them after school. Let me start. Who is Sandra Bullock, Brian? Tell me what you know about her. Spirit, tell me what you know. Like, tell us about Sandra Bullock, Spirit, Angels, and Ancestors. Mm. The letter G. And we all know Grand Masonry. And I've been saying this shit the whole time. And she a part of the what? A cult. And we got robbery at the bottom of the deck. And that's stolen opportunity. She has stolen opportunities from people. <laughs> come through, Spirit. Oh, shit. All this was just about to come out. Set the fuck up. Beat the fuck up. I think they'd only two. They was about to come out. Let's, let's put one here. And one here. Who is Sandra Spirit? Oh, shit. Um, I got one to three people right here. Friend or motherfucking foe. She act like she your friend, but she really a fucking foe. But didn't I explain that to you, face it, strength card earlier? Didn't I explain that shit? Come through, spirit. Mel. Friend or foe. She, Brian. She she was not his fucking friend. Mm, goddamn. We got pure fucking evil. We got suffocate and fatality. Death by war disease or... War disease or accident. I don't know what his form of death was, but it's bullshit. He was probably sacrificed, y'all. Like, at a grove. At a grove. Um, but he did suffocate. Um, he, he suffered some type of suffocation. Or she knows about deaths that were, that, that ended in suffocation. <clears throat> At these rituals, but I I think that that's his death. I think that um I don't know what happened to him, but I think that he suffocated during the fact. So I don't know if he was um like breathing and something and and something um you know how your airways start to close up, but it's almost like I can't breathe, like gasping for air, like that's what I'm feeling. And then I got a sociopath for your ass. Um, sociopath for your ass, Sandra Bullock would give me that because she seems like a girl next door. What's that movie I'm, I keep saying right now with she's with somebody? It's like a movie. It's like two of them. It's um, it's Sandra Bullock. She got on a suit. She like an investigator or something. I'm seeing that movie. I can't remember the name of it, but it's like she can show you something that she's not. But I explained that in the beginning of the fucking reading though. Um, we got F at the very bottom. Um, the only word I can say right now is fatality because fatality just came out along with these cards. Um, but if y'all can make sense of the letter F, y'all let me know. Abuse is in a cut. And then we got, oh shit. Self-defense, um, will be in a cut. And then power had flipped over. And like I, I explained earlier how she wants to have all the power. I explained that earlier. We got the letter H at the bottom of the deck. I don't know what the H is for. Y'all let me know. And we just want to grab a few more cards and then this is going to be it. Spirit, angels, ancestors. Sandra Bullock, what are you guilty of, Sandra? Mm, goddamn. That's it. That was like full cards. Oh. Didn't I explain her being too nice? <laughs> come, come through, spirit! All right, these are the last three cards, y'all, and then this is it. We got the letter I, and that's the all-seeing I, and we talked about her and her practices, right? Oh, shit. Um, we got the letter V again. Y'all let me know. And we got drowned. Uh, and we got suffocate and we got accident. So he drowned in something. He could have drowned in um, his own blood. He could have drowned in, um, again, suffocated because that is also drowning. Suffocation is drowning of some sort of like lung type of situation. or And or um, uh, uh, somebody put him in something and uh and you like cornered um i'm seeing cornered okay gratitude spirit come through i'm it's weird because i'm seeing a rat inside of an empty pool 
but it's in the corner. It's like stuck in the corner. It's weird as fuck. I don't know where that came from. Y'all let me know. Empty pool, right in the corner. That's what I'm getting from also from this card. So y'all help me um make sense of that. But anyway, thank y'all for tuning into Making Doubt Stuff and Raw and Unfiltered Fucking Tarot. I really missed y'all. I'm about to go live. Um and we want to go live and talk about these football players. I don't know what the fuck going on. A lot of these football players are dying and a lot of celebrities are dying too. And I think that they're just taking some of their organs and or um, cloning these individuals and putting these celebrities inside of their bodies. Because um, I have a list of celebrities that I think um, got body transfers. Clarence is one of them. Clarence, the one who wife died, that entertainment guy. Um, he's one of them. Um, it was another, I didn't write their name down, but there's another older person in the entertainment industry that they said passed away and he's old as shit too. And I said, no, these young guys are collapsing everywhere. Y'all are like, putting shit into other bell y'all putting your consciousness your consciousness into someone else's body and y'all making sure that that body got all functioning organs so y'all taking it from the freshest people that y'all could take it from i don't give a fuck what nobody say that's how i'm feeling and that's what we got to talk about love y'all the life make sure that you i'm um, drinking plenty of water you feeding somebody that can't feed themselves you playing praying for thy neighbor make sure you're not entertaining and negativity because bitch i'm not about to do that all right i'm a little tongue-tied but i ain't been out here in a minute and i miss y'all niggas so, this is where it said, I'm going to see y'all in a minute. I'm out this bitch. Peace. Yeah.